for me again. Can't help it. Cricket's on. Can't sleep now. Probably will in about 10 minutes, but can't now. Anyway, another little tell, tale. Um, this is quite a funny one, I think. This is just something I remembered from... This is about seven years ago. This is pretty good, considering my memory. But anyway... Um, me and Chi, we went into town to do some shopping for various things and we thought we'd just have a wander around as well and look at other stuff. And uh, we found this little store that had got lots of... It was, well, we were in a market, it's an open plan market, Liverpool, St John's Market, was, yeah it was. And uh, we found this store with lots of little things in it like batteries and toy helicopters and you, oh, you name it they'd got it but it was always a, a quite a re reasonable price now. but they had novelty lighters and I, I usually stopped to have a look at the novelty lighters so we'll use this as an example I um, I was just standing there minding my own business bear in mind I'd had my hair cut and I'd got product all over my hair and uh, Sinead while I wasn't looking Sinead picked up a lighter and she used it and she was amused by it because it did musical stuff and the flashlights and stuff and I thought oh, she said to me that was it she said oh Chris Chris listen to this and look at this but she just put it by my ear so I could hear it better because it was quite noisy and then she lit it to make it make the noise but I think she'd forgotten that it had actually it was actually full of gas and the flame lit and so did my hair and I didn't know my hair was on fire in the middle of town so then I've picture the scene I've got this black girl beating me on the head as hard as she can because she's panicking what <laughs> and me going what the hell? I, I didn't know what I'd done wrong I thought I was just getting a beating for nothing <laughs> but yeah my hair was on fire so it didn't. It wasn't that bad. The only, the worst thing about it was having to go home on the bus, and uh, I had to sat, sit there, and all I could smell for the rest of the day was the, the burning smell of hair. And I, you know, everybody must not like that smell. I don't like it at all. And because it burnt the hairs in my nostrils, obviously, because I must have turned around and the flame went round, and all I could smell was burning hair. It was horrible. But it was also exceptionally funny when we thought about it after she... Sinead will absolutely wet herself sometimes when you mention the fact that she set my hair on fire in the city centre. But uh, there you go. Just another little tale that I couldn't resist to make. Hope everybody's good, because I'm tired, but I can't give up on the cricket. Can't speak to everybody soon. <laughs> Oh god, I would have stopped the video, haven't I? See, that's how tired and dumb I am. <laughs>